Well, hello everybody and welcome. And today we are going to fit the uh, mirror guards that I bought uh, at the Shepton Mallet Motorhome Show. So, some of you have been asking about uh, <laughs> why we don't have the uh, mirror protectors on, and the reason is that I've, you know, we we left them, the old ones, the Malenko uh, mirror protectors on the last van on the Hymer when we gave it back to Travel World and I've been waiting really to see if I can find uh, the mirror guards properly and have a look at them before I buy them well good luck uh, because I am standing outside of the mirror guard yep. stand here and we're just going to go in and have a look at those and show you those and how much better quality they are. I had a little look at them a bit earlier and they are massively better. So let's go and show you those. So uh, we're at the uh, mirror guard stand and I've decided to buy a couple of these. Paul, who, you manufacture these, don't I you? I do. Yeah, yeah, so Paul manufactures these and they are absolutely so, so much better than the other ones I bought <laughs> from Milenko. They were rubbish. Um, these are they're, they're actually like a crash helmet but they've got that nice um, foamy stuff on the inside that you find and they really are if I put that down <laughs> I mean, that's, that's hurt my fingers um, so, so I'm gonna buy a couple of those they're 120 quid for the pair so probably uh, just less than double the price of the Malenko's but probably ten times as good so here we are I'll show you it after I pay the money <laughs> I haven't already fitted them um, I haven't done anything yet but here they are this is the one for the the passenger side here it's got the the gap for the indicator and the two long arm uh, spaces there and it just fits on over there but it needs to be cleaned first so I've got um, my favorite cleaner the method and I'm just going to give that outside a really good sort of clean on that area And that cleaning is really so that um, these these sticky pads will stick on and you'll notice the difference between this one and the old Milenko one is that these are five mil thick and they have this uh, sort of interior crash helmet material which is very springy um, on them to give that extra protection um, and the the advice is put them on um, and get them get them level and then whip them off make sure that they are okay to fit then take the sticky pads off and push it back on but first a bit of washing up liquid on the um, on the thing here just to give that a bit of sort of lubrication um, just to you know just get that round so that that will actually slide over the plastic mirror because you don't want it really getting stuck halfway and then you know not really working and going on properly so it does really need to be I suppose when it rains this will all bubble up <laughs> we'll, we'll wonder why it's why it's bubbling with uh, washing up liquid so let's just uh, get that and that goes on 
do here. Let me just pull you round to the other side. Now that's working. So this goes on and he says just make it so that it is flush with the edge there. Get it right on. I think that sort of just sort of uh, makes sure that it's, it all fits on without it sticking. Then pop it off. Take these uh, sticky bands off. And then pop that back on so that it fits on and sticks nicely. So I'm just going to really push that home against there so there you go that's the mirror guards from mirror guard uh, fitted and uh, they're nicely protecting the mirror that's a nice solid uh, feel to that now and I feel comfortable that the mirrors are not going to break um, the great news is that uh, when I spoke to the guy from Miraguard, he did agree that he'd give us a small discount for anybody that called and ordered and said they were from the Happy Travellers and that they'd seen the video online. So give him a call, get your order in and tell him that you're from the Happy Travellers and you'll get that small discount. Always worth having. But remember, if you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up and why not consider subscribing if you want to follow our journey as we live full time in our motorhome and travel around the UK and Europe. Remember, if you want to be a super subscriber, ring my bell, it's just down there. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye bye for now.